everything in this scent. This scent just gonna do it for me every single time. I see this little like yum yum sauce, like hibachi yum yum sauce. Like, wait, I don't want the pop on me now. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all know vanilla scents be having them in a choco, literally. The girls that get it, get it. Okay. On the count of three, bad, bad. y'all it's your girl Jura and I'm back with another video so y'all as you can see by the title you girl is back with another hygiene haul I gotta keep it real with y'all y'all know normally I sit on products for like two weeks before I make a video and wouldn't touch them but I'm not gonna hold y'all I touched at least two or three things for shows make sure you subscribe so your girl could put you on to some hygiene products you know, we're not going to talk about swab up in this video, but mm, I only have one swab and it's a, we're going to get to it when we get to it, but just make sure you subscribe so I can put y'all on and so y'all could keep up with me. Okay, let's get right into the video. Now, first I have is a T.N. Dickerson's Witch Hazel. Y'all know I love this Witch Hazel. I did want to try the Equate brand. I think it was the Equate brand. Girl, I wanted to try the Equate brand Witch Hazel, but I was like, let me stick to what I know. I'm doing skin cycling right now and using Witch Hazel tone using a girl every day i'm just like you're gonna need another bottle okay i don't only use witch hazel on my face if you know you know this is it i'm not going in no particular order normally y'all know i'll show y'all all the body washes first all the uh, epsom salt all the bar soap no girl i'm just picking up how i got my stuff lined up and showing y'all as we go anyways this is now y'all know i love this this is the aches and pains muscle relief by the village naturals therapy brand girl i'm not gonna hold you every time i go to get the big bottle big jar whatever you want to call it it's always out of style i mean i could tell my mama okay when you at walmart can you look to see if they got the big body bottle of this epsom salt because I love this. It smells like menthol and spearmint. Like, imagine you soaking in a tub. Even if you had a long day at work, girl, imagine you get up in that tub and you just soaking up. Mm -hmm. Girl, this is a good Epsom salt. Now they do, I am still kind of sick too, y'all. So if I sound love funny, that's why. But they do have like a, is it like a body wash or a bubble bath? I'm not too sure. Or is it like a two-in-one, like a body wash and a bubble bath at the same time? Girl, I'm not sure. But it come in like this little jug with a handle. I need to get my hands on that too. I never heard nobody talking about this, but yet again, it's always out of stock. What's we'll tea? This is it. The next thing I have is the old design of the Suave Body Wash. Like I said, I've been holding on to these products since I made that. That video with the ivory, when I didn't know they had ivory dish soap, laundry detergent, and all that. And I found out they had like a new, not new, but it's new to me. They got a new scent in the ivory body wash. And y'all know I love ivory bar soap. And I love the big body bottles of the body wash. Girl, I've been having these products since that video. Go back and see how how long ago that video was mm -hmm. yes ma'am yes ma'am when i tell y'all i be having a, i be having it sometimes i just don't get around to recording it. i be having to record other stuff okay anyways but this is the ocean breeze this is the only swap i have in this haul today now y'all already know one thing about it i love a fresh and clean type of scent don't get me wrong i love a bust down good scented body wash bar soap body scrub but nothing's gonna be a fresh and clean scent like this scent is just clean that's all i can say it's just clean if you see my swab video which you probably have which probably why swab got some changes to their brand but y'all know i love fresh and clean scent clean linen fresh cotton this ocean breeze it's just gonna do it for me every single time but this is it the next thing I have is the Dr. Briner's Peppermint Pure Caster Bar Soap. Y'all know I don't buy Dr. Briner's Peppermint Liquid no more. I mean, I could, but the bar soap just a bust down and it's going to do it for me every time. I like buying the liquid baby unscented one because you could use it on your downstairs area. Y'all already know I told y'all the little trick. Put in a little foam pump bottle. Put some in there. Add some water. Shake it up. And you got your own little feminine wash. No need for the honey pot and everything. That's for it's made for babies. It ain't gonna do no harm to your downstairs area, girl. But this is it. I'm not gonna hold y'all. Dr. Varner's is pricey. The next thing I have is the lavender and honey cream soft soap. Now y'all already know I told y'all it's been a while since I bought soft soap, but I really like this lavender and honey cream. I think I already told y'all back in the gap. Your girl wasn't really a big fan of lavender, but lavender been growing on me like the past two years. I love a bust down lavender scent. Mm. 
formulated without parabens and all that other stuff real moisturizing i just love this period the honey cream okay i don't know if i really explained this because it's been a long time since i had this one but this smells more like lavender than the honey cream like the honey cream is just on a scale of one to five you can smell a honey cream like like a three but the lavender is like a 10 like the lavender really overpowers the honey cream that's supposed to be in here but either way the cut go it smell good it feel good on the skin and that's just done on that so next let me get these out the way this not really hygiene related but they did have at least like four people in my dms asking me girl what kind of pre-workout you use when is we getting our body up Dave, is you doing 75 hard? I think I answered that too. Like, a few of y'all keep asking, you doing 75 hard again? I thought you said you was going to do 75 soft. Girl, I think I answered that. Girl, I ain't doing that again. I'm sorry. I ain't doing that again. I might make up my own little champ, but I ain't doing that again. Not 75 hard. Not 75 soft. Mm-mm. Not it. Mm-mm. Nothing. Not even 20 hard. Mm-mm. But for the girlies that been DM me, asking me, you know, body up day, workout routine, even though we're workout routine is I feel like that's a very person to person I came up with my workout routine just from doing it and seeing what works for me because girl for all I know girl I don't know if you got a bad back I don't know if you got a bad shoulder because I got a bad shoulder but I still be doing my little my little diddy okay I got a bad knee from my car accident okay my right knee is bad from my car accident my left knee is bad from middle school girl when we was doing girl what is called the little shuttle run test for gym girl I had messed up my knee but I bet you I had got an A okay but I don't know like my left knee not that bad but my right knee is toe down toe down so I mean I could give you my workout routine for the girlies that's asking but to each his own you know modify it to your liking okay so this is the pre-workout I use by six star I normally use the watermelon one, but this time I got Icy Rocket Freeze. It's the pre-workout explosion one. This one, it low-key really tastes like them Ice Rocket popsicles. Girl, is the flavor a little strong. I'm not gonna hold y'all. It's a little strong. Then, and y'all know whenever, when Walmart didn't have the watermelon one, I was going to the Fruit Punch one. But girl, I got my hands on the watermelon one from Six Star website. Yes, ma'am. And I gotta tell y'all, they shipping. When you order from them, it don't ship out for like eight days or something. If y'all like me, when I order something, girl, I expect to get a notification to my email ASAP with the tracking number. Not shipping out for like eight days? Mm. But the brand is nice. I love it. The next one I have is the pre-workout Explosion Rip. This is the one I started my whole, uh, workout body recomp journey with and i've been rocking and rolling and rocking and rolling with the explosion ripped one this is the watermelon one you could take one scoop with six ounces of cold water before your largest meal or take two scoops for pre-workout and i love this so much and the last pre-workout I have is the pre-workout Explosion, not Explosion Rip. And this one is in the Pink Lemonade. I haven't tried this flavor yet. So Pink Lemonade, I can't really give y'all a rating of the flavor, the Icy Rocket one. That one is blue on a scale of 1 to 5. I give it like a 3.5 in flavor. It's not my favorite. I tried the Fruit Punch one before. The Fruit Punch one is definitely a 5 out of 5. And the Watermelon one is a 10 out of 5. Girl, broke my scale. I love the Watermelon one so much. The next thing I have is some candles. This is by the Mary's Handles brand. These are based in Louisiana. Y'all know I'm from Louisiana. This is from West Monroe. So if you don't stay in the area, you can order from the website, I guess. www.maryshandles.com When I tell y'all, y'all need this purple one. I'm not, I'm not going to tell y'all twice. Okay, this candle is not to be played with. I'm not going to hold you. It do burn a lot of soot, but don't burn it all day. I burn candles all day. Don't be like me. Be better, okay? But this candle, it smells... Mm. Girl, whoever in charge of Mary's candles... Um, girl, can you see me? Because... I've been buying Mary's for a long time. This one is the scent Birds of Paradise. Yes, ma'am. Y'all, I will try to remember to link the website down below. That way, if y'all want to buy these candles, y'all can. Y'all be taking your girl word, and I'm not going to hold y'all. Take my word for this candle right here. If I ain't never told y'all to buy no other candle, buy this one. Get y'all that purple one. It's definitely a 10 out of 10. Now, this one is also by Mary's Candles. This one is the Creme Brulee. Now, this one, if you don't really like, like, that butterscotch creme, brule, creme brulee type scent, you might not like this candle because not a lot of people like baby. 
baked goods candles or baked goods smells in general for the house but one thing about me i love me a creme brulee i love me a pumpkin pie scent candle i lo i just love them type of candles it just smells so good mm, this one is definitely a five out of five it's not a ten out of 10 like that purple one but this one is definitely a five out of five like i said if you don't like a butterscotch creme brulee type of scent you probably not gonna like this but i'm gonna keep it 100 it smell good this is it if you don't feel like a candle is part of like hygiene self-care type stuff what is you doing girl a wax milk a candle it's just gonna do it every time what you gonna, what you do when you taking a bubble bath what you what you do when you done cleaning your house why you cleaning your house you burn candles right girl that is a part of hygiene self-care so next i just had to show y'all i got a big body pack of this about five squares missing this is the sea breeze one i used to buy the candle but y'all know since i got a buzz down wax milk now i'm gonna buy the wax milks okay so i got a big body pack but already started using it i wasn't even going to include this up in this haul but i was like mm, let me just show them okay so show that i really really like the scent now this is the sea breeze one like i was saying this is what it looked like girl one thing about it it's like this lime green color mm, it just smells fresh and clean i like fresh and clean scent so the subscriber that told me about the johnson and johnson spray i cannot find it i cannot find it when i went on amazon that john said 30 something dollars for one bottle i said this can't this can't be right i can't remember if you from canada or not because it's it's like three girls that always dm me from canada and always like have you tried this have you tried that have you tried this and i'm like girl wait for the egg girl you in canada okay i can't remember if you in canada because i believe you told me you found it in like target i i believe you told me it's in target i need to get my hands on it i'm not paying all that money for that though i need my hands on it though i need it next let's get to something i didn't open. this is the eos shea butter 24 hour body moisture vanilla cash mirror lotion i was trying to save it because i got this i'm gonna let y'all know because it's coming this month anyway i got this vanilla scented hygiene haul not hygiene haul hygiene shower routine coming up and i bought this because i don't let go to left and i was like no i need to give the girlies like brand new products when i'm showing y'all y'all options for a vanilla for a buzz down vanilla scented shower routine girl i opened it if you never tried this lotion I don't know where you been. I heard the pink one is really good too. So I might buy that out one. This one is a bust down. Forever gonna be a bust down. But this is it. If you ain't never tried this lotion, you either been under a rock or on another planet. This is one of my top lotions. I love this lotion with every bean in my pot. I don't know if y'all remember me talking about the purple dial bar soap. I never tried this one. I can't wait to try it. Mmm. Mmm. Wait, okay, this is the Calm and Soul deodorant bar. So, antibacterial lavender and jasmine scent. It says gentle on the skin, too. Hold up. We all know antibacterial soaps is drying to the skin, but this smells mad good. Like, if I can't find a body wash to match this, at least come close to it. I wonder if Dow has a body wash in this scent. Girl, this smells amazing. You smell the lavender, but the lavender is real faint. The jasmine, the jasmine is what i smell the most on a scale of one to five this is a 10 out of five 10 out of 10 i recommend scent wise but y'all know i use dial bar soaps all the time so i'm pretty sure if it's formulated the same way as the other ones it's 10 out of 10 in my book i highly recommend but this scent this smells good this smells mad good but this is it y'all next let's just get to something that i didn't open and wool paper thin when i say paper thin y'all i mean paper thin i love this scent and it's always hard to come by this scent first of all if i'm getting it online it's hard to come by this scent at a reasonable price and if it's a reasonable price on a website nine times out of ten sold out i hate to pay nine dollars for tree hut okay y'all remember when tree hut was like five something then it went to six something then it went to seven something then it went to eight something and some places it's nine ten twelve dollars i refuse but this is the moroccan rolls i just need everything in the scent the scent just gonna do it for me every single time if y'all haven't tried the moroccan rolls and if y'all just like i don't really try tree hut i highly advise y'all to try this this is it 
Next thing I have, and I don't want to hear, girl, you just had that in the last hygiene hall when you was in the bathroom. Girl, please shut up. Please shut up. Do not do not be rude. Because y'all know I like to buy multiple of things. That's just how I am. I don't care. This is the tree hut. Y'all got to see by the color. This is the coconut lime. And I got the other one in my hand that was in my other hall. This is the one that was in my other hall in the bathroom. Okay? And this is the one that I just purchased. No, it ain't really much I can say about this. It smells good, period. 10 out of 10, I recommend. This hygiene haul little long. I'm not gonna hold you. They also had a girl. Well, they had a girl and a dude. They asked me, what do I use to wash my dog? If y'all don't know, I got a dog. But y'all should know that. That's my baby. That's my child. Let me know if y'all want me to dip in what I buy for him. Because I recently did buy him some shampoo. Some little doggy cologne. You know, I recently just got him some of that. The cologne I'm not the biggest fan of. It smells good, but you know, we could find something that smells a little bit better let me know because back in the day y'all used to ask me to add my stuff that i buy for him on my amazon storefront and i need to update that too y'all if y'all ain't know your girl got an amazon storefront majority of the stuff that i didn't talk about in past videos probably recent videos is probably on them because girl i stick to what i know but at the same time i be trying something new just like what's in my hand right now like i said if you saw girl when i went on a, a little rant because i ain't know ivory had detergent and everything for the clothes y'all saw that i peeped two things the last two things i'm about to show y'all i popped that into the video and i was like this coming up in a hygiene haul but this is also for the vanilla video okay i don't want to say too much because then y'all might not watch it but that's for the vanilla video too this is the happy place lazy weekends body squirrel sweet almond and vanilla bean <sighs> okay let's be 100 right now i tried happy place hand sanitizer and like lotion never tried this scrub and i'm not gonna hold y'all i'm not the biggest fan of how this look if you saw that video then you saw i said this look like yum yum sauce like hibachi yum yum sauce like i don't want this to be a catastrophe like the mango body scrub so it's like can y'all see it's like jiggling and it look like yum yum sauce smells amazing though i can't wait to see how this y'all like just it just look like yum yum sauce y'all i can't wait to try this oh my god this is looking like crawfish dip okay but this is it i'm gonna need y'all to get your hands on this that way when i make that vanilla shower routine video y'all can pull y'all products out and go hop in a shower and see how true the shower routine gonna be like i'm gonna be telling y'all i'm not gonna show y'all if y'all want me to do the shower routine then i could do it but i'm gonna be telling y'all the products to use when i tell y'all this smells amazing girl 10 out of 10 smell wise okay and the last thing i have now i tried body wash from this brand before i think everybody didn't try the one i'm about to say the coca the coconut one the one in the white bottle this is the ogx brand no i didn't try what the coffee one too yeah i didn't try the coffee one and the coconut one the white bottle one that's coconut huh yes but girl this this is the shade. Have I tried the pink one? Anyways, that's not even in this haul, so we're not even going to stress ourselves about that. But this is the OGX Shea Soft and Smooth Body Wash, girl. It says decadent aroma. Y'all know I love when a body wash or any brand in general use words like that to describe their scent. And the word matches what the scent is smelling like. This smells decadent. If you ain't never tried this, wait, I don't want it to pop on me now. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Girl, it's a hydrate your skin with a rich blend with shea butter, agave, and coconut oil. It leaves skin incredibly moisturized and light scented with notes of vanilla and warm, decadent, frosted treat. Girl, when I tell you, you gonna smell like a buzz down tree. And y'all know, y'all know vanilla scents be having them in a choco. Literally, okay? The girls that get it, get it, okay? But this is it. If you ain't ever tried it, you need to try it. You need to make sure you get this before I release that video. You need to make sure. You need to make sure. Get it, girl. Just get it. Okay, y'all. So, that's it for this video. I had... I think this was a big haul. I'm sorry. Y'all know I said I was trying not to do the big hauls because when I go to edit it, I just be trying to cut so much stuff out. And one thing I don't like doing is cut my personality out of the video. But I don't like my hygiene hauls to be mad long. And I don't like them to be mad short either. I got to find an in-between but this was a lot this was a lot huh y'all yes but anyways that's it for this video y'all make sure y'all like comment and subscribe make sure y'all rack up on these products 
especially vanilla scented ones because like I said I got a vanilla scented show routine coming out and I want y'all to have the products before we have a situation like with the Walmart Equate brand body wash being sold out and the suave ones being sold out I don't want y'all to be stuck in saying dry I can't get my hands on the body wash I can't get my hands on the body scrub I can't get my hands on it girl I told you before I even released the video so that's it for this video y'all I'm gonna see y'all in the next one bye on the count of three,